All righty, my friends, let's go into uh, Angles grocery store. Let's do it. If my ankle will let me, I've been having problems with my ankle. My ankle popped a couple days ago, and I don't know if I sprung it or what. Let's get a little small buggy. Let's do it. <clears throat> Say hello to me, YouTube channel people. When you first come in the door, there's ice machines, wipes, which I don't know if they have any. Are they out? They could be out. I don't use no more anyway. Right now, I ain't worried about it. ice machines. 10 pound bags, 212, 20 pound bags, 388. You got umbrellas, 598. That ain't bad for these huge umbrellas. I mean, they're large. Heck, I might get me one of those. Those ones I got in the car are small. All right, people, let's do it. Right here to the left is the pharmacy. Oh, they have great popcorn too. Ashley Ingalls <clears throat> is my favorite popcorn that comes from the deli. They do a great job. Yeah, Root City's probably about the same. Both of them's good quality. They bake, uh, usually make it every day and it's fresh. Here it's four bags for five dollars. So you can't beat that with a stick. But I wouldn't get four, I'd get maybe one or two. And their popcorn is really good. And here's your pharmacy, my friends. <clears throat> Hampton Farms Peanuts. All right, I'm gonna probably just shut up and uh, they're playing music, so hope I don't get a copyright infringement. To the left is your wine and <clears throat> your beer, which they have a lot of it here. If I quit drinking, so I don't have to worry about it now. Got to think about my health. I'm getting old. I'll be 55 next month in October. So any beer you want, they got it here. Imported, whatever. And they do have very, very good prices on beer. So if you're in this area, Angles, and you want beer or wine, this is <clears throat> one of the pl <clears throat> good places to get it. And they got all kind of nice selections of wine too. <clears throat> all right, well, yeah, I'm still recording because the light's blinking. And I'm using my DJI, forget GoPros. GoPros, they are they can they shoot some of the best footage in the daytime, and if you're outside, it keeps it perfectly stable. But if you're inside a building, it gets a little jerky because it, it's electronic stabilization, so it's perfect for outdoors in the daytime. But indoors, DJI Pocket too, you can't beat it with a stick. And if you want to zoom in on something, let me show you something. I mean, this is about the grocery store, really, not about my camera. But let me give me an example. See how I can zoom in with the DJI Pocket 2? With the GoPro, you can only zoom in before you start recording. The GoPro here, 11 Black Mini I have, you have to zoom in before you start recording. Once you start recording, you can no longer zoom in, which to me is crazy. Anyway, Sargento Cheese, 418. <clears throat> it's a little pricey. Most places it's 349, 359, 379. Little pricey, I think. I mean, it could have went up all places. Cause it says 538 on sale for 418, so it could have went went up. Cabot cheese, a dollar. It's used a 418, dollar 98. Now that's a great price, a great uh price, great price. Gouda. I don't really like Gouda cheese. Uh, you see what it says on it right here. Really quick. <clears throat> Cabot Habanero Cheddar Cheese. Well, I bet that's hot. Cabot Habanero. Ingredients, fresh milk, cheese custard, salt, enzymes. Gouda, it's, it's pretty good. It's not my favorite, but it is good cheese. From our cooperative of a farm family since 1919. It's all natural too, so that's a good thing. I do love Pepper Jack. Goat is pretty good. Love Pepper Jack. 
Uh, <clears throat> they got Gouda Light 75 down here. I guess it doesn't have as many calories. Cabot Extra Sharp. For $1.98, you can't beat that. Eight ounces. We got Laurel Land. Laurel Land is the Angles grocery store. That's their brand. And Angles, if you did not know, started in Nashville, North Carolina, which is about, let me see. Asheville is about, let me think, about 86 miles from here. I lived in Greenville, Tennessee. Asheville was 60. So from Kingsport, I think it's about 86 miles. Right at 90 in Boone, North Carolina. Boone, North Carolina from Kingsport is only 73 miles. And that's one of my favorite places to go. Resort town where Appalachian State football is. Anyway, Laurel Land is the Angles product. Ash, uh, Angles started in Asheville, North Carolina. That's all you need to know. And that's the rest. That's all you need to know. That's the rest of the story. No, not Paul Harvey. So you got your cream cheeses. I know Fishy Comics like cream cheeses on YouTube. Check out old Fishy Comics if you get a chance. Nobody's here, so this is the perfect time to film at night. We just passed all kind of bottled water, sparkling water, pellet, greeno, and all that good stuff. Powerade on end caps, Coca-Colas, water, Sargento sliced cheese, $4.98. Like I said, I think that's a little pricey from what I've been, I mean, you know how groceries keep going up week to week? I've been paying it, I think, about $3.49 to $3.79. Me and Sonny's already bought a bunch of cheese. We was at Walmart last night, we bought a bunch of cheese. <clears throat> uh, hope everyone's having a wonderful night right here is all our yogurts and I ain't got, I ain't got time people to tell y'all everything so I'm just going to walk get a few items maybe and then uh, try to get on out of here you got pretty much any water you want all the way down through here they're a nice store eternal spring water I guess that gives you eternal life Deer Park, I buy that all the time. Over here's your eggs. You got your creamers right past the yogurt. And of course you got your sour cream over there and your Dean's uh, ch ch uh, chip dip. You got your eggs, eggs. They got good prices on eggs. 248 for jumbos, that's not bad. For jumbo eggs, Laura Lynn brand. You got your Minute Maid. I love Simply Lemonade. Does anybody else like Simply Lemonade? Simply Orange Juice. Simply. Oh, there's a Simply Peach. Another Simply Peach. And down through there is more uh, teas and drinks and craft drinks and all that. I'm going to shut up. So <clears throat> I do like Simply Orange. Simply lim simply orange lemonade is four at forty-eight for the fifty-two flow ounce. Or you can get the uh simply lemonade is always cheaper, it's usually on sale. And it is, of course, this is orange juice, it's right next door. <clears throat> you can, it's marked down to two eighty eight and that's a good deal. It really is. I really ain't in here to shop, I'm just really in here to make a video, but I gotta look like I'm shopping. I might get a few items because I don't want people to know what I'm doing. But really, I don't care. I'm bold. Uh, one of my favorite orange juices is, uh, oh, I've seen a new orange juice I've never seen. It's right here. They've got Natalie orange juice. Never heard of it. Must be all organic. $7 for a half a gallon. It's too high for me. I ain't rich. <clears throat> I like a... Uh, let me see, I just saw it, where'd it go? Indian River, orange juice, man, that's really good. No, I saw it. Florida Natural's pretty good too, down on the bottom. Indian River, this is good, half a gallon. Man, it's really went up. It's $6.38 for base of 52 ounces, that's high. Say hello to me YouTube channel. Keeping it real like big ball of oil or whatnot. I run the show. I run the show right here on the big old show. I ain't shy. Your best customers in here. I dance in front of people. I ain't shy, people. And if people try to give me a hard time if I'm filming in public, I just start acting crazy and they get the hell away from me. 
<laughs> Praise the Lord. All right, people. You know, I got 127 IQ. People high intelligence are a little bit on the crazy side. But that's all good. When I grew up, I grew up drinking seal test milk. Seal test, baby. I think I get me a two percenter October the 9th. Seven days for my birthday. We'll go with this one. 224. It's kind of a big one, but I like big. I usually just get a pint. This is a quart. Seal test. Now, they used to sell seal tests everywhere. I grew up in Northwest Georgia. I was born in Cedartown, grew up in Rome, and that was the main brand that was sold up there, Seal Test, and I think Seal Test and Borden. <clears throat> There's your poop paper down through there, your paper towels and your trash bags and foil wraps and foil aluminum pans, mason jars. All right, I ain't got time to tell you everything in the store. This will be a 10 hour video. We just gonna walk and talk, keeping it real like a big ball of wheel or whatnot. You feel me? That's how black people talk, don't they? But you know what? I lived in Atlanta for 23 and a half years after I lived in the country for 16 years. Now 16, I moved from the country in Rome, Georgia, down to Atlanta. And I went around because black people, and that's the way they talk. Keeping it real like a big ball of oil or whatnot. You feel me? Macaroni, Bob Evans. Hey, would you like to be on the news? I'm doing a documentary. No. You sure? All right, I'll cut you out, man. I right, see, that's a new little camera, and I'm testing it. It's DJI and I do documentary videos on YouTube. Oh, wow. But if you don't want to be in there, I'll catch you out, boss. All right. Have a great night. Wrong. I ain't taking them out either. If, you, if you're walking by me, you're stuck in my footage. I don't care. All right. 488 too. But this is 93% lean. Look how red it is. The redder, the more lean it is. Now, I'll show you the difference. Look here. This is 98% lean. Laurel Angles brand. You can tell it's great burgers by how red it is. Guess you can see. Now let's get one that's not 98% lean. This is ground chuck. Ground chuck is 80 to 85% lean. This is 80% lean. See how this is not quite as red? Let me show you. See here? It's not quite as red. We will lay it beside them. That's 80% lean. This is right 93% lean. It's a lot redder. The redder the meat, the hamburger meat, the beef, ground beef, whatever. The more lean it is, that means the less fat. All right, I ain't got time to explain everything, people, just some things. And that's not bad, 304 for two ground chucks. I've got four ground chucks at home. We got Hormel here. Hormel here. And I tell you what, this is some of my favorite macaroni and cheese right here, Reese's. Made in the uh, state of Washington. This is jam up macaroni, the best macaroni you can get in plastic containers. It's 458 for a family size. That's not bad at all. I'm not going to really do any grocery shopping tomorrow. I'm just pushing this buggy around. I got me a milk in there. People don't like it. They can kiss my butt. Cause I'm from the south. I got a big mouth. I'm a YouTuber. I got some studs down here, probably be on, want to be on YouTube. Look at the port, nice port. Now, Food City and Angles is the two best grocery stores. Food City and Angles, and I like Kroger too, but I like, I think I like Food City, and then Kroger, then, the, I mean, Food City, then Angles, then Kroger. I like Angles, Kroger about the same. Food City is my favorite. All three grocery stores is great. I used to like Prices, Prices Foods. Their groceries have went up so much, they're higher than most other grocery stores. You want to be on YouTube? What's up? Say hey, hey, I, I, I was up down there blogging, and I said, no, most people don't want to be an old man back there. I don't want to be on the YouTube channel. I said, come on, man, I'm shooting a documentary. I don't want to be on it. Now, I was looking towards y'all, and I said, these young studs want to be on my YouTube channel. Say hello to my YouTube friends. Hello, YouTube. What's your name? Cash. Cash? Last name for Cash or first name? First name. First name's Cash, like Cash Money? Yes, sir. Well, shoot, you need to play the lottery then. <laughs> What's your <laughs> name? Tyler. Tyler and Cash. And you look me up on YouTube, you just type in Big Old Kingsport, you'll see me this hat, the biggest mouth in the South. <laughs> All right. Big Old Kingsport. YouTube. Have a great night. Cash and Tyler, I remember that, buddy. Y'all have a good one. All right, this is the seafood. We're back here at the deli. See here, seafood. Now, they, 
they have a great seafood back here. They really do. And Delhi with fresh cuts. I mean, they keep everything nice and clean. They get they get pretty much anything you want here, just like Food City. I love Cajun seasoning. My favorite is Tony Sasseries. I'm cheating a documentary is what I tell people, so I don't get all paranoid. If they think you're just vlogging, I mean, just recording, be re recording, they go crazy. We ain't got time, to, like I said, to record everything. I'm kind of beefed up tonight. I'm surprised I'm so hyped up. I ain't even had my cup of coffee today. Matter of fact, la whole cooked lobster. $15.98, that ain't bad for a whole cooked lobster. Guess they don't have them, they don't have them fresh here, I guess. But frozen, you see, it's already cooked, so all you'd have to do, put it in the steamer, I guess, or put it in that. If you don't have a steamer at home, you could boil it, I guess. It's already cooked. So all you'd probably ha need to do is probably heat it in the oven. I've never ate, uh, ate one that's already cooked in a box like that. It's $15.98. And you got fish over here. They got pretty much anything you want up here. But <clears throat> my favorite deli is at Food City. Their deli here is pretty nice. We ain't got time to, to catch everything. I'm shooting a documentary for PBS on TV. So I don't start telling people so they don't get paranoid. Bacon, bologna. Oscar Mayer is my favorite bologna. Y'all remember that song growing up as kids? When I grew up, all they had was beef bologna. Now they got all kind of bologna. You know, pork, beef. We had pork and beef when I was growing up. They got chicken bologna, turkey bologna. I mean, too many choices, man. I like beef, but it's just too high. So I get the Oscar Mayer that's chicken, pork, and beef. 368, that's not too bad. Uh, most places I think the Oscar Mayer beef, chicken, and pork thick cut is about 278, which, which will just, eh, that ain't bad, this one right here, that's the original cut. Now the thick cut's 378, so that's a little high, but not still not bad. But that's my favorite right here, the chicken, pork, and beef thick cut. Slap some uh, mayo, some Hellman's, or uh, my favorite, Duke's on some Texas toast. I, I toast my red first, slap mayo on it, then slap that thick bologna. That's what I'm talking about. We got frozen shrimp here. And one thing I have did notice, I don't see no fresh shrimp out that's, you know, been stained. I just see it in prepackaged uh, bags and stuff. Food City, they keep, it, they keep it out fresh, you know, after they steam the shrimp and put it out put uh, Old Bay seasoning on it. I did not see that here, but I still am impressed with our deli. Look here. It's neat. It's organized. It's clean. Just like Food City. What more can I say? Hey, that's what I'm talking about. Blogging like a big boy. Like I own the world. Stick my chest out. I got a big mouth. I live in the South. I talk to myself when I'm doing documentaries like this. How you doing? I'm doing a documentary for PBS. Would you like to say anything? On grocery stores and the rising cost of groceries. It's going through the roof, ain't it? Yeah, it's coming back a little bit. I think, well, I heard some people say it's going to keep going up and some of them saying it's going to come down. What do you think? Keep going up. I think it is. Yep. And gas too, I heard it's going to go up. Yep. Well, everybody don't want to be on PBS. My news. Of course, I'm not PBS people. I'm just, just telling people that so they don't freak out. If you're walking around with a camera, you got to be cool. If you say you're shooting a documentary, they don't freak out. You know, they think you're legit press, which I am legit press. Did you know you did not have to, there's no such thing as a press license, a press permit. A lot of people think you walk around the camera and you see people with that badge around their neck on a little rope, it says press. There's no such thing as a press license. Look it up on Google. If you want to be a press and tell the news and put it on YouTube, you are the press. There's no press certification. There's no press license. And that's all I got to say about that. So I'm shooting a documentary. Big O with the big mouth in the South. Now that's what I'm talking about. What's popping in your neck of the woods on this terrific Thursday? Cupcake, six count. Six count cupcake, 648. A dollar. 
a little bit over a dollar a cupcake. What would it come out to? About a dollar, I mean, excuse me, yeah, about a dollar four or something like that. Four times six. Maybe about come out about a dollar six cents for six. That's not bad. Double layer cake, Oreo cakes. And over here is the deli. Man, they're playing music. Lionel Richie, so I won't be able to make no money on this video. It's all good, though. Can't make money on everything, I guess. I seen y'all somewhere before. Man, that's cool, riding in the buggy. Yeah, I got hey, life's too short. You can't get these 24 hours back. You gotta be happy, man. Be happy, positive, focus, stay away from negative people, try to do the right thing. That's the way to do it. Tyler and Cash. Yes, that's sir. what I'm talking about. Right. Y'all gonna be the biggest stars on, my, on the video. The only thing I hate was when I was playing music like this copyright right i can't make a dime off of it if you're walking through somewhere and they're playing music guess who gets the money the people for the song so i don't even get no money for it Goodness. so I'm, I'm gonna post it anyway you know <laughs> they, they don't give you a strike hey the only way you get a strike which can be bad on your channel is like if if you you're, you're you just come out with a new song and say i post it without your permission because what what they do is if they lionel richie's songs on there they say, well, the copyright owner agrees to let you use the music in the video, but they get the money. But say if you just come out with a song, you're a musician, I put it on my YouTube channel, on my video, and, I, and you say, hey, I don't want that song on there, that, then, I, you know, I either have to take the song out of the video or take the entire video off YouTube. If not, you get a copyright strike. You get three that they take down the YouTube channel. I never got one because they always give you a way out, you know? Yeah. Hey, y'all have a great night. Tyler and Cash. Cheese, cold cokes. We got the coke machine here. This is where they make fresh brewed tea. This is the slushies. Over here is the deli. And I'll tell you something I like. It's right over here. It's their cornbread. They make some jam up cornbread. Fresh donuts. <clears throat> Sonya loves these rolls. But they just keep going up. Doo -doo -doo. They don't have no cornbread. They used to have a bunch of cornbread out. Oh, here, or have I missed it? Here's assorted croissants. They got some fresh cookies. That's what I'm talking about. And over here, look, that's all the the ones in the frozen section, the, the cakes or whatever, and the coolers. And then here's the deli. They can make anything you want here. Now, they got a nice deli here, too, now. I'm not knocking it. They're close, right up there, close with Food City. This Angles grocery store. Look at all this food. Here's the deli back here. See? Let me put my glasses on. Make sure my camera's lens is, is focused where I want to focus it. It is. It's all good. And over here's the deli. They got boar's head meats, fresh cut meats. No salt added, tortilla chips. So tortilla chips, no salt added. Breads, fresh meats, boar's head. The, let the party begin this, this right here tells you about the trays and all that good stuff that's last meat if you want it fresh you know freshly sliced here's some more popcorn you can get the smaller smaller ones four for five you can get the large one 2.99 or you can get a small three ounce bag just a single bag which is this this is a three ounce bag for dollar 25 or you can get four for five and it, right here is the hot bar. It's already closed down because it's like nine, nine, what, almost 10 o'clock. Some people have to hurry up and try to get out of here. But I don't see my cornbread. I did not see it. So, I guess they didn't make none. Oh, oh, here's the cornbread and muffins right here. 
250 that's not bad and I'm gonna get one look how beautiful these are see this 250 and the large one bone large man this is big that I ain't never seen them make this cornbread this big this is a huge and looks pretty good what's the price let me flip it over for a big one six dollars I can make now <clears throat> that's a little high to me for just a pound of cornbread of course it is huge this 250 is a good deal Look how big these cornbread muffins are. This is the Mexican cornbread. So I don't I don't see they usually have regular cornbread too. This is the Mexican cornbread. They're playing a bunch of music in here, so I hope it won't mess my video up. So I try to I like to make try to make a few dollars off the video. They're just blasting the radio. Lionel Richie, everybody. Alright, back back here. Y'all know this is my one of my favorite pickles, and this is the best pickle you can get in a plastic bag. Van Houten's $1.25, that ain't bad. I'm going to get one. I will get one. You can, <clears throat> they, are, they have one bigger than this called a Big Papa. Huh? No. Did you like being on YouTube? I'm doing a documentary. What's up, YouTube? Uh, I'm, I'm bragging about y'all's groceries uh, yeah, that's store. What I thought you were doing. I, I love doing. the grocery store. And that's what my, fa my favorite item. It angles is this right here. The yeah, cornbread, God, it's good. I make it fresh every morning. Yep. Y'all don't have the regular cornbread, y'all have the Mexican, but I love it too. Uh, I love the Mexican or the regular, you know? Yeah, the regular probably sold out. Probably. Yep. But this is good too, I like it too. It has little big chunks of what is it, like jalapeno in it or something, it's, don't it? It's uh, jalapeno, I think pickled pepper or something like that. Yeah. Stuff like that. Yeah, check me out on YouTube. If you type in Big Old King Sport, you'll pull me up. Big Old I've been, King Sport. This week I did a review on uh, Food City, Kroger, Target, uh, I, was, I, I might go back and do a Walmart one, but I've been on there for a while. I had 10,000 subscribers. I got hacked. Now I had to start back over. I'm almost up to 4,000. So, oh, that sucks, but, that but I loved. I do like uh, restaurant reviews, uh, food reviews, uh, gross. You know, like stores and stuff, yeah. and product product reviews, and then uh, I do blogs. Uh, well, What's your name? Brandon. What now? Brandon. 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 My real name's Owens, but the people call me Big O. Just go on YouTube, Big O King Sport. You pull them up. You see me just hat. Have a great night, my friend. So Brandon, his name's Brandon. Right about did all I'm gonna do. See people, he can't be shy. But hey, they got everything you want too here. Now look at all these machines. Now I like this, the Mountain Dew or the Sun Kiss. <clears throat> Tropical Fruit Punch, I bet we get. That ice blue, raspberry lemonade, Kool-Aid. This is Kool-Aid brand right here, these two. These are Sun Kissed. And fresh brewed coffee for $1.50. I mean, fresh brewed tea, that's cheap. All right, right here in these containers, they have fresh nuts. Over here, they have fresh nuts in these containers. Fresh fruit in, in packages. Look here. If you want it, they got it. And we're going out back towards the front. And over here, on this side, the, the deli is the fresh fruit. It's in containers like they have at Food City, your watermelon in big plastic containers. Your veggies are down here. <coughs> Fresh cut cucumbers, carrots, whatever you want. See ya. Pre-packaged. Your Marzetti Ranch dip. Your big containers of uh, freshly cut fruit. I mean, freshly cut uh, vegetables. Over here's your fruits. With the Marzetti cream cheese and yummy. Here's one with cantaloupes, all kind of stuff. Watermelon, pineapple, fourteen ninety eight. That's cheap for a huge one. This big, that is cheap for one that big. Most places about twenty dollars, about eighteen to twenty. Get pretty much anything you want. Look here, you can get purple onions already sliced up. Your uh, bell peppers. I mean, this is a nice store, people. Like I said, it started in Nashville, North Carolina. And they took over the sale test company, the you know the dairy company. Watermelons, there's, you got your bananas, you've got everything here. Apples, oranges, everything you want. Like the, the only thing I don't say that I wish they had was like fresh lobsters in the tank. But over here, look how it, neat and organized. This store is neat and organized too, just like Food City. Very. And over here is all your veggies. Look here. Look how neat everything is. Barrels and wooden containers. 
your pumpkins, anything you want. Fresh bags of almonds. Watch this. The water's fisting to turn on. It don't turn on on here. You hear it? You hear it sound like the sprinklers if it's turn on? It does it. The only time it does that if you have stuff down here. Like your uh, lettuce and your cucumber saps dripping. See, it just turned on down here. That's why we heard that little thunder. They got, I mean, their stuff is very fresh too. Just as fresh as Food City. I'm impressed. They do a great job here. I think that lady walking back there is the manager, way back there in the white shirt. And here's your fruit bar, your olive bar, salad bar. It's closed, of course, right now. They got anything you want. They got great sandwiches here. Look here. One of my favorite is the egg salad. They went up on it. it used to be $2.49, that's $3.99. But boy, it's thick. Look how big it is. And look at this tuna salad sandwich. See, they're thick. So $3.99, it's still worth it. Man, look how huge it is. Pimento cheese. <clears throat> Man, salads even look good. Fried chicken salad, $4.99. That's a good deal. Eggs, cucumber, chicken. Fried chicken salads. Down here is this chicken Caesar salad. Nice, nice containers. They do a great job. I'm impressed with this store. Three slices for for three dollars or two for five. Pizza. And like I said, up here they make fresh subs. See that sign? Subs. Every day. Pizzas. They got it, people. They got it all. Look here. They've already, this stays cool on this side, so they just wrap it with plastic at night. See here? It, the cooler side's turned on. I was talking to the manager at the deli, bragging about the store. But what I was gonna say, even their the flower place over here is super nice. Blooms and flowers. And this right here is Starbucks. See, here's the flowers. Okay. All kind of healthy, healthy greens. What is this? Oat grass. Oat grass. You can buy these containers. Floral. This is the floral department. And over here are Starbucks. Of course, it's closed right now. They've got a Starbucks in here like Food City does. And this is what it looks like. This is the entrance where you come in. The doors right here on the right side. And you come in. This is your fruit and vegetables and all that. And you got Starbucks. I'm going to hit the resters and get on out of here. Thanks for walking along with me. Down that aisle is your chips and your Cokes and all that good stuff. Mainly just to get in here and just do a video. That's all it was. All right, we're going to close it out. I don't want to try to film anybody. Uh, thanks for walking through the store with me. I appreciate it. Please like, comment, subscribe as always. Be happy, positive, and focus. Share my videos. Hit me to grow right here on the Big O Show. I love everyone. Until next time, my friend, good night.